Hello, this is 100 Dino. And XXUSBOX X1. And, and today we have um, combined our channels and we have made a new channel called Dino Juice. And today we'll be giving you, and following on from today, we'll be giving you tips, tricks, hints, and reviews on all these different Minecraft things. So today we'll be talking about the 1.3.2 Minecraft TMI mod. And if you guys don't know what that is, it's actually too many items. And the privileges of this mod is pretty much it's an in-game item spawner, such as you can see here. Oh, wait, sorry. There you go. Uh, yeah, so the, there's really good. This is a really great mod. And let's start with that. This mod allows a delete mode. So what it is is if you've got loads of dirt, which is you don't really want, you simply just click the delete mode, and you can just click the items you don't want and simply just turn it off. Um, another mode is that it allows you to turn on creative mode, so, so it says your game mode has been changed and I can just fly around and stuff like that. You've also got rain and snow which I can toggle and it'll start raining and that's really annoying when you that's really great if you've got you know it's a rainy day and you're trying to do something and you're trying to get rid of the rain. So anyway, it basically lets you control the game. Like you get to do whatever you want, basically. Yeah. So if you're stuck during survival mode and you want to collect wood, you can save 10 seconds of your life and get and just collect wood, just like this. Uh, yeah. So here I can just simply just click oak wood plant. And right now, if you have a look down the bottom of the screen, um, it's, we're on survival mode and we did that. Yeah. Anyway. Um, yeah, uh, you've also got an option of setting the time and date. For example, um, I can either set it to sunrise, which it is now, noon, sunset, or full on nighttime, which is what's happening right now, which is great. Um, so instead of wasting 10 seconds of your life building a house, you might as well just do this get some wood or even diamond and you can build your own house anyway sorry about for this inconvenience but there's this guy trolling us right yeah now. okay um what's also great about this mod is so you can see yeah i'm holding about 444 blocks of diamond and what i can do is i can just save it and kirk could you please kill me that's all right now you've seen i've died now when i click respawn i simply just click e Right, and now you don't see I don't have any items with me right now. But simply click load one. Oops. Yeah, so simply just click load one and it allows me to load the items that I've just lost. So basically you don't have to wait and waste another 10 seconds of your life and go collect those items again. This is also really helpful if your your items are actually out of reach. Say so they're in a cave and you don't know where you are. And uh, you're trying to find your stuff and, and by the time you get to the place where you die, the arms will probably despawn by now. Um, anyway, out of um, 10, I'd probably rate, rate TMI. What do you reckon you'd rate it? I'd probably rate it 8 out of 10. I, I, I think I think it's really good that you're able to have an in-game item spawner. It also gives you great control of um, the time and the difficulty of the game. It also, um, you know, can toggle weather and creative mode off and off or on. Anyway, I probably rate it an eight out of ten as well, as it saves your saves your ass so much time, and you can do so much stuff. Okay. Yeah. So um, also, one thing that I would like to say that has changed in this uh, mod is that you have you are able to just simply press a no. Um, a button which allows you to type in the item you're looking for and then it will you know make it easier for you to find the item you want anyway um thanks for watching please subscribe to dino juice also check out our other channels um xx juice box x x1 and also um 100 dino anyway um please comment subscribe and see you next